Hit record. Almost, but I got it. Uh, that would have been real awkward. Okay, now I need to remember what I was doing in this game. The void, but somehow different this time. Oh, it's different. -y. What's up, Ebony? How are you? I made you flee your precious tower and turned your father into cold stone. How difficult for you. But when I was young, the sweet Jessamine and I were closer sisters, sharing a secret. Emperor Caldwin had another daughter, born in shame to a kitchen maid. I'm pretty good. I'm really, really tired, so it's going to be a short stream today. It's always next year, isn't it? It's always next year. During the day, Jessamine and I played games in the tower. But at night, I'd go back to the servants' quarters with cockroaches and thin gruel. Emperor Daddy would visit and tell me if I was good. Next year, I'd be old enough to come to court to be a princess. Then one day, pretty Jessamine broke something worth a fortune, and the spy master caught us. She claimed I did it, and he whipped me in the garden house until I bled. My mother lost her kitchen job. And that night, we were out on the streets with no place to sleep. Damn. I didn't break it. You were just playing. No, no, you just... It was your account. It was her. No, I was lying. She broke it. Dang, bro. Talk about family drama. Sheesh. A lot of his backstory do be kind of sad. Yeah, she had it rough. Shit, no wonder she she threw a coup d'etat. <laughs> My God. Mother and I saw the nastiest parts of Dunwall, ending up in debtor's prison. Jessamine died quick on an assassin's blade, but my mother lingered for weeks after a fat guard broke her jaw. They threw me out when she died. I looked up at the lights of Dunwall Tower and swore revenge. Washing bedsheets in a brothel, I painted on the side until Anton Sokolov took me as a student. That's the polite word for it. I was crafty even before the outsider marked me and survived the worst the Empire could offer. No, it's your turn. Oh, it's my turn now, huh? to know whether my dear old aunt is telling the truth or not. It is kind of hard to know. Who knows? Who when knows? I saw what they'd done to Anton Sokolov. I wanted to hurt everyone who'd helped Delilah and the Duke of Sirkonos pull off their coup. Sokolov is the man who made whale oil into a weapon, who turned back the plague, and now he's barely able to speak that painted the most powerful men and women of our time shake too badly to hold a spoon. When he does talk, he's going to give me a name. The next step along the way to Duke Luca Abel, then Delilah herself. A name. That's all I need. 
Yeah, the art style is really cool. It kind of reminds me of something, but I can't quite put my finger on it. It's almost like a um, like a nicer looking Borderlands style. wasn't a dream, was it? Am, Am I to blame for Delilah's bitterness? All this is her doing, and she'll die for it. Our decisions, decisions have weight. I, I feel, feel my time, time drawing to an end. Soon. Oh, look at them rats. Where are your wee bastards going? Down there. Okay. How, how do I put it away? Okay. What's wrong with people like that? A restless mind and an empty heart, perhaps. Jindosh would have snuffed me out as soon as he got bored. I appreciate what Emily did for me, freeing me from that place. I searched for you, Anton. I would have found you. I knew you'd try me. They kept me going after they gave me to Jindosh. Either way, you're back now. I'm glad. Hold on, I just realized I recognize her voice actress. Ah, uh, the Empress has risen. A peaceful sleep, I hope. Nothing like the pillows at Dunwall Tower, made of goose feathers. I think she's Ikora Sarah, from Destiny. You want to talk? Anton, you've had three days to rest. Tell me how to kill Delilah. They tortured him. His body is covered with bruises. Delilah has the throne and my father is missing. This is Anton Sokolov, the greatest mind in the Empire. No, Emily. Megan is right. I can make electricity move from one side of the room to the other. But Delilah is beyond my understanding. When I came to Sirkonos, I meant to leave everything behind. But when the assassination started, I couldn't ignore it. By the time Megan and I connected the murders to the Duke, it was too late. The Crown Killer came for me. It kept me alive from my knowledge that I saw things. Jindosh often had a visitor, Brianna Ashworth. She's the curator of the Royal Conservatory. Yes, Ashworth is dangerous, as obsessed with the occult as Galila. Apparently, she's working on a device called the Oraculum. There's more to her than either of you know. If Ashworth is one of Delilah's lieutenants, I need to eliminate her. Who knows what this device is capable of? what she's up to. Who really knows? So the stiff. We'll take the skiff. I don't want to bring the dreadful whale any closer than we have to. There is a small dock in Syria Gardens, close to the conservatory. That's as far as I can take you. Yeah, sounds Ready like a plan go. to me. Yeah, let's go. Let's do the yes. thing. Let's go. be a grand guard presence outside the royal conservatory inside be prepared for anything ashworth runs with an eclectic crowd they'll be the real danger someday i'd like to know more about how you met ash voice actors in a million tv I shows and movies would. just looked her Trust up me. and some other in games too gotcha to Delilah, which brings up something else you might be able Thanks, to Ebony. The Abbey of the Everyman and removing she sounds very similar to uh, Ikora Ray from Destiny. and Karnaka has been watching Ashworth from a hidden outpost near the Royal Conservatory. Check it out first if you want more options. 
Remember, if she's still working with Delilah, Ashworth is a great threat. Thanks, Megan. See you soon. Okay. Find out what vi- Oh, I couldn't read that. Fuck. Outlawed Umberwood export to protect the trees. You can't keep track of all the decrees. Ah, hell. Nobody. You didn't see anything. Oh, she'll have a fishy on a little dishy. Oh, she'll have a fishy when the boats come in. Ooh. Items. Not in the mood. Show yourself. I don't want to show myself. You're a punk. Ah, oh, hell. Oh, I don't want to do this. Ah, oh, hell. It's fine. It's fine. Oh. I was templar temporarily betrayed by my crossbow. But only temporarily. It did. <laughs> I think I can get in through here, right? Kind of dry. I really go for a whiskey or something. Maybe one of those two penny drinks. Maybe not, but it's fine. You didn't see nothing. I swing at thee. We shall have a. Why do I have that song stuck in my head of all the songs? Come from where the fuck did you come from, buddy? Oh, these overseers, no respect. Ugh. That could have been bad. Royal 
So, Ebony, how's school going for the week? I believe Ashworth has some connection to the occult in Karnaka. Something is happening that I don't understand. The overseers are the forward faith of the Abbey, but equally important are our sisters from the Oracula Order. To be direct, I suspect something is wrong within their sect. Subtle changes to the types of proclamations they've been making. Small, but troubling deviations from tradition. But publicly saying anything along those lines will get me accused of heresy by my rivals within the Abbey. Is it possible that Ashworth has infiltrated the Oracular Order? So Vice Overseer Byrne thinks Ashworth is interfering with the Oracular Order. If true, it's another reason she has to be eliminated. School's okay, humiliated. Yeah, humiliated myself by talking in class today. I'm also super tired. Damn, that sucks. Like, was it like you got cut and got called out, or or what? But I feel you on the tired. Apparently, today, my brain decided that I needed to wake up at 7:30, despite going to bed at like three in the morning. Or four in the morning, it was somewhere around there. But my body insisted. But yeah, what happened with talking in class? If you don't mind me asking. Oh, what the hell? Oh, come on, I was trying to switch to this ability. Come on, man. I didn't mean to shoot. <laughs> what the hell? This is why you have the safety on and finger off the trigger until you're ready to fire. Plus, had a meeting with the author of the book we read. We made up questions and topics in advance, and I just ignored that and just freestyled my question. This is why I don't ask questions. I don't ask questions. I'm afraid I'll sound dumb. I would always wait for somebody else to ask the question that I had. <laughs> uh, especially... <laughs> Especially in like calc and shit. I was I never asked questions. I was just like Yeah, either somebody else will ask it and it'll get explained or I just will figure it out. One of those things will happen. <laughs> I, I knew what would happen if I opened my mouth. <laughs> this is why I started streaming. Calc is so cursed, yeah. I have to agree. There was one comp site class that I had to drop because of how fucking cursed it was. And so I'm gonna have to take it a different semester, but... I, I uh, called up some people I know who work in, in... as computer scientists, and... They all told me, like, yeah, just, just drop that class. Just drop it and take it by itself at some other semester. That class sucks. So I was like, alright, that's what I'll do. <laughs> Two more months, she says. Then she'll leave him. I can wait. Yeah, I've I've been very lucky to have a lot of a lot of people in my life who already work in the field. And they they've been super helpful to me. Oh hell, where do I, how, how do I get in the sneaky way? Can I get up there?
<laughs> Keep my mind on my duties. Damn, I need to pee. <laughs> it was just... <laughs> This is really funny timing for both of those. But, uh, Ebony, do you know what binary is? And what bits are? Yeah. So imagine doing multiplication and division with 32 bits. Or with 32 bit numbers, I should say. And then imagine having to do a metric fuck ton of those, like 20 of those. So that 20 times. On top of a programming assignment where you have to program an assembly. And uh, for reference, assembly language is not quite machine code, but it's close. For machine language or whatever you want to call it. It's like a level uh, above it. But yeah, class fucking sucked. That class in and of itself was a full-time job. Am I going the right-ish way? Oh, hell no. Oh my god. Oh man, this is oh hell. How do I deal with that? I don't I don't have a flammable bottle. But yeah, anyway, I totally feel your pain on uh feeling stupid. In a in a class. That's what I thought. Well, I know it's a bit different, but that's what I thought in my comp sci class for the longest time. I was like, am I just dumb? This was a mistake. This was a mistake. I don't know why I did that. I knew what would happen. I did it anyway, though. Maybe I am dumb. Fuck. like teleport over there uh, for the conservatory I think there's another way to the left of the main entrance where the marker is oh okay then I will just set that there Be something over there. Looks like I might. No, I can't. Oh, maybe down there, though. Where the rats are. Shit. Oh, 
Whoa, 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 buddy. Whoa, 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 whoa. Ah, oh, hell, this is bad. I thought I saw someone right here. Let's check the place just in case. Okay, fuck it. Let me demonstrate how I earned my officer's command. Fuck. What was that? I just got knocked the fuck out, man. They shot me. Wait, where am I? I took one comp sci class when I was in engineering and it was mostly fun, but the assignments were so frustrating. What comp sci class did you do? me just reading a book Someone there? no nobody's here nobody's here at all you don't see anything you don't see nothing you don't hear nothing It was a first year class that all the engineering students had to take. Probably just an intro class. Yeah, probably. If I had to guess. It was, it was probably like one of those classes just to kind of get a basic idea of programming. And since a lot of those other fields use, uh, use programs. Or did you not even have to do Stack Overflow was my bestie. As it is with every programmer. Well, unless you directly ask a question. Then prepare to be... Have yourself insulted, your mother insulted, and everybody you've known and cared about insulted. <laughs> But when you're not the one directly asking a question, it's a great site for uh, for help. Apparently there's these nasty bastards here. The bugs are definitely worse than the rats. Oh no. I need to find out how a sword through the heart wasn't enough to kill our new Empress Delilah. Cheap magic. Oh you piece of shit.
Ugh. Uh, I was wrong about being on the left side, but I knew there was another entrance somewhere. I found it eventually. Where did you come from? That scared the hell out of me. Jeez. Oh shit. I also. Oh hell. I haven't been looking for runes or bone shards. What the fuck? Okay. Okay. There's something to this. Okay, that's what I thought. I see. I once was blind, but now I see. The door is blocked. Of course it is. Hmm, I see. Archive key. Oh, rewiring tool. Okay, so there's a rune up there. There's a rune over there. Actually, I might be able to get this rune up here. Lots of dogs and witches in this building? Oh lord. I knew this world 15 years ago. That doesn't bode well for me, honestly. But the world seems strange. Can I not go out there? Really? Oh wait, hold on. Maybe I can finesse my way. I cannot finesse my way. Oh, I see. There's another, another dog head over there. Rune over this way. Sometimes that works when you stand on the statue. Okay, I'll try that then real quick. Locked from the inside, eh? Oh. Okay, that's fine. There's an entrance over here. Ew, wait, what the f What the hell is that? Oh. I don't want to deal with that. I'm going up here. Oh. Oh. That's really quite unfortunate. What the hell are you? That rune is so close I can taste it. Will you attack me if I stand near you? You will attack me if I attack you. Yeah, that's fine. Whatever. You, you do you. What are you going to do? Chase me? I bet I can jump this. Yeah. That one, maybe not so much. What? Uh, you're mad at me? Okay, I guess I was just out of the other one's field of vision? I 
don't want to have anything to do with these guys. Let me in! Oh my. What sort of horrible things were they doing to you, buddy? Yeesh. Oh, that's uncomfortable. Vice Overseer Burns' suspicions were right. But a curious thing happened on the way to the altar, Delilah. From the first time I slipped out of the manor in the dead of night, there was no returning to my cage. Looking at the stars and drinking wine on a rooftop, I was free. Instead of seeing the Overseers for marriage, I visited my father's banker and raced away from my old life toward Delilah. Fuck. Well. <laughs> well, um. <laughs> I didn't know I was already where I needed to be to assassinate my target. Oh hell. That's so uh, well. Uh, moving on from that. To what Ashworth is working on. It's her fault for walking in on me, okay? I was doing stuff. And then she came out of no ways. Suffering from success. <laughs> yeah. Man, I'm gonna get the bad ending for being too good at killing things. Oh, man. Okay, I thought for sure this would be a way to the bone charm. Or not the punch room, the rune. There's that one there. That one way over there. This one down here. Just need to figure out where I'm at. Yeah, that's in there. Perhaps here? This is a really interesting area. I swear, they hide these runes so well. Or at least how to get to them. Like, holy shit. Wait, is that a collectible painting? Mother, would I even be in this situation if you'd lived? Uh, good question. It's a massive building. Yeah, it is. Like, holy shit. Okay, well, it looks like all the runes except for that one are down a level, and that 
Someone might be in there. Was that me who made that sound, or did somebody just get pissed at me? Find out next time. Okay. It was Yerf. <laughs> Don't mind all this blowing over here. It's nothing. Don't mind that either. It's nothing. Silver egg? Can I make them dr drunk if I throw alcohol at them? That's logical, right? Oh, have they moved on? Dabble in the art of Moida. Oh, holy, holy crap, indeed. That's crazy. You Behind you. Alright, where's my rune? That's what I came here for. One more rune than I had before. Can I get anything? Yes, I can if I want to. Uh, I kind of like that one. That one's pretty cool. Throw objects farther. Increase health and resilience. You know, it's one of those things. Uh, it's one of those things where it's like, you know... Shadow kill and domino are super useful. Where was shadow kill? Yeah, that one's super good. Uh, domino. What's the second level in this one? Okay, so that's all enemies. Transform it. Oh! I will become the Bloodfly King. I have found my calling. <laughs> nice. 
The other one is nice too if you care about being able to double jump. Oh shit. That's another good one then, yeah. Double jumping is pretty nice in games like this, so then you don't have to... Ooh, hi! Wish I could double jump in real life. Uh, honestly, me too. That's very relatable. <laughs> Oh hell, oh hell, oh hell, oh hell, oh hell. Where's my gun? I need my gun. Okay, yeah, that's... Oh my god, they're doing me what I did to their friends. Oh my god. Okay, so maybe don't, um... Maybe don't just teleport into the middle of the room? Maybe... Did it save my power? It did, okay. And maybe don't do that. Maybe plan ahead a little bit to avoid um, very quick death. Hm. Yep. It says runes over that way. Like multiple of them. Hold on, I, I have a gift. Well, that was not what I was expecting to happen. But it still did work, so I'll, I'll, I'll take it. <laughs> it's a little bit anticlimactic, but I, I killed a few of them. That's all I really needed it to do. Amber. Very nice. Yo, Emily's got the precision of a fucking god when it comes to the sword. Just being able to smack these bastards out of midair like that. Unless she's doing what I'm doing and just flailing haphazardly. Uh, canonically, that is. Okay, there's Bone Charm in there. I don't think this is where I go then to... Yeah, I don't think this is where I go. Bone Charm would probably be nice, but... Well, actually, I am already here. I should probably just... Um... Okay. Do I have something I can toss at them? Anything at all? Nope. Uh, no, you see nothing. Bugs, you see nothing. I guess I'll go downstairs here. Here. Yeah, this seems fine. Oh, potato! Very nice. Wait, where are my sleep darts? Are these my sleep darts? No, those are just my arrows. Uh. Oh, hell. I don't remember how I get up my wheel. Hold on a second. Uh, left control. That's what I put it to. Okay. I see. Them some dead witches. I 
what's over there? Okay, come on. I know you're mad at me, but you can't get me. It looks like you're on the wrong side of the wall. <laughs> Stupid. Stupid. Don't worry, I'll see if I'll come to you instead. Never mind, I don't think I can. At least not from this way. Man, this whole area is a fucking maze. No idea where where to go. Yeah, I know you're very angry. So, what's the uh the lore behind the uh angry plants? Or would that be too spoilery? Hopefully this doesn't get me killed. Nailed it. Oh. Or just something the witches have for some reason? Gotcha. These witches are crazy, man. Oh my. Where'd you come from? Oh, oh. That's one way to deal with that problem, I guess. <laughs> Just fucking yeeted her off the ledge. <laughs> I yerfed her. She's probably learning a book or note somewhere, but they're just there to guard the witches pretty much. Same with those demon dogs. Gotcha. These witches have some crazy shit going on, that's for sure. What the hell? Nothing. Yep, nothing. Absolutely nothing. So are the are they the witches related to the old hag in any way from the first game? I hope it doesn't interfere with the tinctures. Oh, jeez. How'd you get here? Huh? Pretty sure Granny Rags is some sort of witch, but these witches are mostly just tied to Delilah. Gotcha. Yo, why are they? Why are they teleporting all up in my business, man? Yeah, sure. That's fine. Who is this 
man carrying gin dosh. Oh my god. Wait, I thought the rune was Wait. Oh. Wait. Oh hell. The rune ain't even even in here. Thought the rune was in here. Fuck. This is a special endeavor important to Delilah. You think no one can harm us, but the overseers and sisters of the Oracular Order are fanatics, dedicated to stopping us from living the lives we want. So why use their own machinery? Your lay who Deadly Yodel indeed. What's in here? Ow. Okay. Duly noted. Don't lack those things. Got it. Got it. Understood. All right, the dogs. Hell. Nobody heard that. Nobody heard that. You didn't hear that. It was coming from here. Let's see. Who's there? Hell. Ow. I won't let you escape. Oh. I had just about enough of your sass. I'm just over here trying to get my runes. Oh lord. I yeet over that way. That wasn't really the best decision I could have made. What? Where'd you go? Where'd she... Where'd she go? <laughs> Did she teleport into the fire or something? Who's that? Nobody. That was some very, very nice uh, aim assist there. Thanks, game. I said... For some reason, that was so dark.
Yay! This journal might tell me more about why Delilah can't be killed. About why Delilah can't be killed? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. She got stabbed. I didn't do shit. After Delilah fell to the assassin Dowd, her magic was lost, and the coven scattered. I made a new life in Karnaka. Then I heard her whispering from the void, leading me to the Duke, who heard those same whispers. Together we worked to bring Delilah back into the world, changing the Empire from the home of Aramis Stilton three years ago. Across the Isles, all of us who'd been with her at Brigmore and before, we felt the magic return. Others joined. New faces, new blood. Now, Delilah is immortal. Forever. She holds Dunwall, and we've turned to corrupting the oracular order. The overseers take guidance from their prophetic sisters, and soon we'll influence their dreams and visions. Very nice. Admirable goals all around. Take this. Shoo. After all, soon enough, soon enough, I will become Blood Flight King. I was once Rat King. But no more, for I will adopt a new title. Rat bastard sounds right, but what do you do for the blood flies? Maybe blood fly bitch. But I get the painting and loot in the one room. Room back here? I don't think I got the painting. Maybe I did. I think I got everything in here. Oh, okay. Bookshelf can be moved. Oh, yeah, you're right. Thanks, I wouldn't miss that. Would have completely missed that. I don't know if you heard my, my little rant there, but Ebony, um, what, what would you pair with, uh, blood flies? Like before I was the rat king or rat bastard, you know, but I, and I intend on being the king of blood flies now. I need, I need a good rhyme there or not rhyme. Something that flows off, flows out the tongue, you know? Flows off the tongue. That's the phrase I was looking for. Jesus Christ, I'm getting tired. <laughs> Your fly. <laughs> blood, <laughs> blood flurf. <laughs> From henceforth, I shall be known as the Blood Flurf. <laughs> yeah, it rolls off the tongue. <laughs> Lord of the Flies, that's a pretty good one.
Welcome in, Seraph Alucard? Lord of the Year. <laughs> Welcome to the stream, Seraph. I wonder if we're ever gonna get bored of. Seraph, thank you so much for the follow, man. Appreciate it. I wonder if we're ever gonna get bored of the. <laughs> the Yurf thing. <laughs> I feel like we have already overused that so much. All right, you know what? I'm just going to say forget about it to the rune. I know that's the thing is it's so dumb, but it's still funny. Nice. It has no right to be that funny. Oh, wait, did I? Oh, I guess I technically finished the mission. That's not what I meant to do. Never mind, I'll go look around for runes then. There's one over there, actually. Oh, but it is in a silly place. I should go for it. Oh hell. Look around. Oh, nothing. You can't spot me if you're dead. Oh, wait. Maybe I should leave that for later when I'm ready to leave. I can grab it on my way out or something. Hello? You saw nothing. Nothing here. Let's have a look around. Nothing here. Let's have a look around. Charms in there. Copper spoon, now cauldron. My name is Delana. I bested the infamous royal protector and ousted his brat daughter to take her throne. Now come and let me bathe in the warm waters of your adoration. Okay. Okay. You know what? I don't like you. He was being noisy. It wasn't about it. Oh, oh, time for my favorite thing. Someone there? Oh, hell. No. Ebony, you've seen the Yodelay who. Now get ready for the reverse Yodelay who. Oh! I didn't know they were immune to that. That's, that's sad. That's really unfortunate. <laughs> Sometimes I remember the on my skin. But the Yodelay who is all I know! That's all I know! You can't be immune to it. It's cheating. I've been out yodeled. Yeah. This is outrageous. It's unfair. The 
yodeler becomes the yodely. <laughs> Gonna be another one that's locked. I can only assume so. Not interactable with at all. Kind of surprising, actually. All right, this is in here. And how do I get? How do I get in there? I don't understand. I don't get. Oh, maybe that's how. Secret tunnel. No, wait, have I already been in here too? This is, is this just? Shit. <laughs> Scorpion be like, get over it. The fuck? Shit, I don't know how to get over there. Damn it. All right, fuck it, I'm tired. <laughs> I'm gonna go home. You can knock that off. Ah, uh, hell. No, you don't see nothing. Yeah, that's right. You don't see anything. Just keep looking in that one direction. That scared me. <laughs> My nerves is shot. I thought I was going to take a lot more damage than I did. <laughs> oh my god, there's so many tripwires. I, I saw the tripwire last second. And so when I, I realized what was about to happen. <laughs> Okay, I'm just blind. Blind as shit. Any more tripwires in here? No, can I can I have my runes and peace now? Look at you. Leaving a trail of bloody boot prints across this dying city. Yeah, that's what I do best. Brianna Ashworth was Emo Peter Parker. Yeah. Forced to win some bloated <laughs> beggar. Her only moments of real freedom, getting drunk at fancy balls, and slipping away to couple with strangers. It would have ended in an unhappy marriage and a late night plunge into an icy river. But just before mother and father married her off, so many years ago, she found Delilah instead. It was all highways and graveyards after that. Never looking back. Vice Overseer Byrne is an ambitious man, but he believes in the Abbey's mission, protecting the good people of the Empire against the likes of us. You know he'd be happier deep down if this ended with Brianna Ashworth's head on a spike. Maybe yours as well. 
Seems like there's a lot of people that want my head on a spike. What is this ability? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I am become the Lord of Flies. Outsider, aka the dude that gives you powers just to waste your time in cutscenes, yeah. This is the uh, alternate universe of uh, Peter Parker where he stays emo and develops some other weird powers. That was a lot of random yelling. Wait, are they sh shooting at me? He loves his monologues. I love his ominous vibes, though. Yeah. He's a good character, but... <laughs> or at least so far, he's an interesting character. But I definitely don't understand him. The outsider seems to be inside the void, though. Thoughts? I don't know. I have no idea. Oh, I saw it there for a second. There we go. There's the other one over there. I'll see if I can get to that rune. Maybe he should be the insider. True. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. Fuck. He should be the yerf sider is what he should be. He just screams yerf to me. <laughs> well, that's what I get for trying to grapple onto a tree. <laughs> Thanks for the bonk, company. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Dying and bonk, yeah. <laughs> I stand by what I said. What are they? Man, it seems fun over there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Alright, I'm breaking the game. I think. <laughs> Maybe the outsider just wants friends. He's lonely. Why did I do that? Oh, it's fine. It's not fine. Okay. I was too distracted. <laughs> oh, no, that's not what I wanted to do. Maybe the outside just wants to be inside her. Ooh. The outsider needs a bonk. The outsider needs to go to horny jail. <laughs> Now 
outsider says there. <laughs> Hey, you know, maybe the outsider is just lonely, you know? He doesn't get too many visitors in the void. Oh, it must be hard to find people that are into similar things as you if you're um, in the void, you know? All I want is this rune. That's all I want. Is someone there? No, nobody's here. Oh shit! I bet this one's carrying corn. Time to die, little girl. Take a grenade. Shit. Take a grenade. Hey, watch out. You watch out. Each. Wait, there's a black market here? Finest service with absolute discretion. Hey, am I just like stupid? Crank wheel. <sighs> Welcome. Now Honestly, where would I put the crank wheel? What am I supposed to do with this here? Please take a look around. We have the best wares for discerning guests such as yourself. Shut up, dude. Let me figure out where I put this crank wheel. Uh, the outsider kept it even though he became a part of two men and two women, so at least he's not picky. Oh, I don't think I've gotten to that part in the lore yet. I don't recall that. Doesn't granny rags. Oh, unless him giving you the mark is, is like him becoming a part of you. Is that how it works? Doesn't Grady Rags also have the outsider mark? Does she? Or did she? I don't know. I don't remember. I kind of killed her. Wasn't paying much attention. Gotcha, okay. Welcome to my shop. Say, an acquaintance of mine is supposed to be holed up in an office overlooking the Royal Conservatory. Check on them if you're headed that way. I check myself, but the streets are locked down. I'd make it worth your time. I'll think about it. Well, I walked See, in on her having some old granny time in the sewers, and then she was, um... She was mad at me. What a pleasant surprise to see you again. Certain you will be satisfied with your purchase. No need to wrap it for you, I suppose. Did you happen to kill rats? Yeah. I killed quite a lot of rats. Please visit again soon. This is uh, my first playthrough of the Dishonored series. And I'm going in completely blind, so. Other than, like, tips I get from chat, I know nothing. Rags loves her rats, gotcha.
Okay, I feel like I was supposed to come here, like, <laughs> way earlier. Because now I've got a side quest to do. <laughs> oh, shit. You can rob the black markets in every map. Yeah, that's what Ebony told me too, but I couldn't figure it out. Couldn't figure it out on the first one, uh, and since then I've just been like, yeah, whatever. I was ignoring the black market. <laughs> no, I'm blind to shit. <laughs> That's all it is. I'm just blind. <laughs> In previous missions, it gave me a waypoint, and I didn't see the waypoint for it, so I was like, oh, maybe there's no black market here. I'm just blind as hell. There's little hand symbols with arrows. Megan's right there, so yeah, it was it was just right over there. Yeah, I'm just blind. I'll pay more attention uh next mission for sure. Maybe. Yeah, we'll see. Gotta say speedrunning this game is fun, but currently doing it on console, so a little harder than PC. Yeah, that makes sense. I'm guessing this game doesn't have a uh, mouse and keyboard support on console. Oh, plus if it did, I wouldn't use mouse and keyboard on console. Yeah, you don't you don't really get to optimize it. Quite a long time ago, I played a game that had mouse and keyboard support on console, and it was it was nowhere near as nice. Mind all the loud noises, it's nothing. Nothing at all. I think I grabbed that actually. Wait, how did I, how did I get over there last time? That's new. Arm blood flies. Shoo. Shoo.
favorite line from the from an NPC in this game was, "Do you ever feel like someone's watching you?" Meanwhile, I'm there pickpocketing her pouch. Yeah, the NPC dialogue is is one of the best I've ever heard in a video game. It's so fucking funny. There, there's been a lot of moments where I'll just sit there and listen to what the NPCs are saying because it's so entertaining. Looks like I need to get over there. What was that? Whatever it was, it's not a concern anymore. The worst thing is, I even said out loud in a response, nope, I'm not paranoid enough for that. <laughs> Someone's shooting at us! <laughs> Someone's shooting at us! <laughs> Where'd you get that idea from? I know, right? He just carries on his merry way. Just, ah, well. Maybe if I inspect the body, I'll find where the person who's shooting at us is. Maybe. Even know this was a thing here. Okay, that one's locked. That one's locked. That one's locked. This is the way you usually go. It makes sense. Pretty good way to get in. Oh, shit. Can I just get in? Oh, well. <laughs> I probably should have, uh, uh, I probably should have suspected that. Um,
Yeah, it's fine. It's not a big deal at all. Yeah. It is what it is. Ah, <laughs> uh, see. What does the button do? Didn't do nothing. Yeah, I probably should have uh, found this route first before uh, going in there, but... Good thing I already killed, like, everything and everyone in this mansion, so it's fine. That rune is bothering me, but I, I couldn't find it earlier, and I don't think I'm going to succeed now, so... Fuck it. It's a window, right? Yeah. Uh, it would have been really cool if you could go up there. What the? Why did I go flying there? Wait, where'd that whale oil go? Damn. It's fine. Hey, where do you I did. Like an absolute gamer. Too bad I alerted everybody in the town, though. Darn blood flies. Alright, well, I've I've just resorted to killing everything in my path. How did I miss? I don't know how it's possible that I'm so bad at stealth in any stealth game ever. It's honestly like my secret talent or something. Well, at least those problems are taken care of. It's a corrupt bone charm. Anyone here? Hold on, I forgot. What does a corrupt bone charm do? Just have uh, negative attributes added. Gotcha. Oh, 
This whole business has me on pins and needles. Jumpy as anything. What was that noise? What's going on? Shit. <laughs> My plan didn't work. Who are you? She's out of ammunition. Oh, I'm... Thanks for telling me. I didn't realize that yet. <laughs> She's out of ammunition. Oh shit, I didn't know that. Thanks for letting me know, man. You were on me. <laughs> Way too fucking tired for this game right now. Sheesh. <laughs> Come in, my Welcome back. I see you found the prototype. Your acquaintance didn't make it. It is a risky line of work, I'm afraid, but let's not dwell. I expect you'll be interested in payment. First your finder's fee, of course, and if you like, I can draw up some schematics based on the prototype, something you can use to modify your tools. And as a token of my appreciation, a discount <coughs> at the shop. A fair deal. Okay, the blood fly thing is one power I avoid. I thought it would make them uh, my friends. Similar to summoning the rats in the first game. It it did not do that. Come in, my friend. Always a delight to see you. All those valuable artworks locked up in the conservatory where no one can see them. Truly a shame. I find the witch is kind of annoying to deal with. Oh, I'm broke as shit. Ah, you want blueprints for better weaponry. Yeah, for real. <coughs> the district is so quiet since the conservatory was. I was good with that. Well, I'm certain you will be satisfied. So realize how short these missions can be once you stop trying to be stealthy and non-lethal. Yeah, these missions get pretty short when you're well. just and going full unga bunga. <laughs> this is the Europe way, though. Shinies in this boat. Your method is rather barbaric. It is, but it is what it is, you know. So it's done. Ashworth won't be a problem anymore. Good. But Emily, there's something else. Back when I lived in Dunwall, I did things that I'm not proud of. Isn't that a requirement for citizenship? What I've got to say is not a joke. I knew Delilah and Ashworth. Bought into their bullshit. Which led me down a bad road. To be honest, before all this, I thought Delilah dead. I don't want to get into it right now. But You're I the one who started telling know. me about it. There are things I regret. You never know who to trust, do you? Everybody makes mistakes, Empress. You'll have to tell me all your secrets someday. Are you ready to leave now? My first playthrough, I bought all I needed from the markets, then stole from them. Yeah, I should figure out how to steal from them. Yes, let's go. Take me back to the Dreadful Whale. I'll do that another time, though. Another step toward the Duke of Circonos and Delilah.
For several years, Delilah's been here, getting stronger, turning people against me. Why didn't I see it coming? What was I doing during that time? Pretending to listen at court, ruling through an army of bureaucrats, waiting for the next chance to get free of Dunwall Tower. Well, now I'm free. If only I could go back. Aramis Stilton was once an ally of the Duke. The owner of Karnaka's mines, Stilton lives in a fortified bunker at the heart of the Dust District. No one's seen him for years, since around the time Delilah started making her moves. But whether Stilton's alive or dead, his home holds the key to Delilah's immortality. Alright, word Ebony. I was I was honestly just about to end the stream myself. I'm sleeping. <laughs> but thank you so much for watching. Go ahead and save the game real quick. <laughs> yeah, I was planning on finishing that and then I was like, I gotta go to bed. I was only planning on streaming for an hour tonight, but I got into the mission, so. Yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, and thanks again for the follow, Seraf. I really appreciate it. Uh, I'm gonna see if there's anybody on to raid. Uh, it doesn't look like it.